Hello mga kawamat, in this video lesson, we will continue our review for second quarter exam in pre-calculus. So, for the first question, in which quadrant does a negative 285 degrees angle lie? So, as you can see class, if the rotation of our angle, now if we're going to rotate counterclockwise, the sign of the angle is positive. But, if the rotation of our angle is clockwise, so, the sign of our angle is negative sign. So, since yung negative 285 degrees, that is clockwise, so start tayo dito, we're going to rotate. Since kapag uh, clockwise, start dito 0, this is negative 90, this will become negative 180, negative 270, and this is negative 360. So, mula dito, papunta dyan. So, ibig sabihin na sa quadrant 4. Kasi kung ito ay negative 270, so nasa quadrant, ay kung ito ay quadrant 1, 2, 3, and 4. So, therefore, nasa quadrant 1, ang negative 285 degrees. So, the answer here is letter A. Okay? Letter A po ang sagot. Next. Which angle is not uh, coterminal with an angle that measures 300 degrees so what we're going to do so ang gagawin lang natin sa 300 mag add tayo then 360 or kaya mag minus ng 360 so you can use your calculator we're going to add kasi 300 this will become uh, 660 ang tinatanong is not coterminal no? not coterminal with an angle measure of 300 degrees Kapag minus naman natin, 300 minus 360, that is negative 60. So, coterminal yung C and D. And then, mag-add pa tayo. If we're going to add or subtract again, another 360, that is negative 420. Kung pag, kapag nag-minus pa tayo dito, negative 60 plus 360 so the answer is negative 420 so malabo na makukuha tayo ng negative 300 degrees so therefore ang negative 300 degrees ay hindi ko terminal ng 300 degrees so the answer is letter B next alright so yan ang terminal angles yan ok next is what is the smallest positive angle terminal to negative 512 degrees. So, the smallest positive angle, since ang given natin ay negative 512 degrees, okay, negative 512 degrees, so, ang gagawin lang natin, mag plus ng mag plus ng 360. So, we're going to add negative 512, you can use your calculator, negative 512 plus 360, that is negative 152. So, ito ay negative pa. So, kailangan pa natin mag-add ulit. Negative 152 plus 360 plus 360. So, the answer is 208. So, kasi kapag nag-add pa tayo ng 360 dito, malaki na yung makukuha natin. So, therefore, the smallest positive angle ko terminal to negative 512 is 208 degrees. And the answer is letter D. Okay, next. At what angle is the value of tangent undefined? So, if we're going to look for the unit circle, so, ano kaya yung uh, magiging ano natin? Saan natin makikita o ma malolocate na yung tangent natin magiging undefined? So, kung titignan natin class, yung 0, that is 1, 0. E, di ba yung tangent? Tangent is y over x. Okay, so that is y over x. So, as you can see, so paano natin makukuha na maging undefined yung tangent? Okay, since uh, the formula for the tangent that is, so kung kukunin natin yung tangent theta, that is y over x, or that is sine over cosine. So, yung y natin, so itry natin dito sa zero. If our y is 0 here, 
So, that is 0 divide 1. So, the answer is 0. Okay, dito yung tangent. Sa 90 degrees, kung ang y natin is 1, 1 divide 0. So, dito undefined siya. Okay? How about sa 180? So, y. So, 0 divide negative 1. The answer is 0. Okay, siya dyan. How about sa 270? So, negative 1 divide 0 that is also undefined. So, therefore, mag undefined yung tangent natin sa 90 degrees and 270 degrees. And the answer is letter B. So, letter B ang sagot natin dito. Okay. So, last question para sa ano natin, review ngayon. The reference angle of 200 degrees. So, we all know naman, ito yung magiging basis natin. Kapag sa quadrant 1, Kapag kukunin natin yung reference angle, kung ano yung given, yun pa din. Pero kapag nasa quadrant 2, okay, 180 minus the given angle. Pag yan ay nasa quadrant 3, yung reference angle natin, so yung given na angle, minus 180. Sa quadrant 4 naman, 360 minus the given angle. Since ang question natin dito is 200 degrees, and yung 200 degrees, malolocate natin dito sa quadrant 2. So, using uh, dito sa quadrant 2, ang reference angle natin is 180 minus the given angle. That is, ano, since that is 200 pala, no, hindi pala sa quadrant 2 makikita. Okay, since uh, 200 degrees, dito yan, nasa quadrant 3. Okay, so sa quadrant 3, Ang given angle is 200 minus 180. So, the answer is 20 degrees. So, letter B ang sagot.